<sighs> Thank you all for choosing me as the school queen. Violetta, you're the best. My friend, we always believed in you. There she is. There's a lot of people here. We can't get nap all of them. Thank you, I won't let you down. That is my crown, give it to me. No, I earned it with a lot of effort. It doesn't belong oh. to you, give it to me. No! Violetta! Oh. Uh, are you okay? I think she's not coming to. Oh, my head hurts a lot. You're already awake. How is our daughter? What? I'm your daughter? Who are you? What are you talking about? We are your mom and dad. Uh, is this a joke? I never saw you before in my life. You just hit yourself very hard on the head. Let's just go home and drink some tea, but... Come on. Ben, let's buy Violetta's favorite candy. Yeah. <laughs> I hope she gets well soon. She's going to be fine. I'm sure of it. I can't stand oh, Susie no. anymore. All of this happened because Anxiety. she wanted to steal Violetta's crown. That's true. Okay, do you have all the candy now? That's right. Let's just take. Welcome. It's her house. Still don't remember anything? The truth is, I don't. <laughs> what are you saying? This is the room where we used to watch TV. And here's the kitchen when we have breakfast every morning. <laughs> That's really cute. <laughs> yeah, it's so cool and her house has a gym also. Uh, amazing. Don't worry, daughter. Soon you will remember everything. Let's go so you can see your room again. I love you, girls. What the hell is this girl doing in our house? Ethan. What are you talking about? She is... She's your younger sister. What? Stop joking already. Come on, walk, my dear. Ethan, you almost ruined it. I don't understand anything. What sister? What are my parents even saying? Violetta? We brought you candy. She's not here. I don't get it. Where is she? I don't know. She was supposed to be here. <laughs> uh, excuse me, uh, do you know where Violetta is? Oh, you're talking about the girl who is the queen of the school? Yeah. yeah. Oh, recently her parents took her home. What do you mean her parents? <sighs> That's right. They came and said they were the girl's parents. And then they left. What don't you understand? Oh, I have to go back to work. <sighs> How come her parents came if she's been in a boarding school all her life? Exactly. Something is wrong. We have to go look for her. Come on. Let's go. All right. What do you think about your room? Well, yeah. It's beautiful. Oh, by the way, these are your dresses. Oh, really? I used these things? All of this is horrible. <laughs> well, to me, they're really beautiful dresses. You know, I have the feeling that it's my first time in this house. No, daughter, it's not true. I just remember that I became the queen of the school, and Emma and Ben were supporting me, and then Susie came to take my crown, and I fell on the floor. Very well, I know that soon you will remember everything. Let's go. What is this? Now I feel like I am crazy. Although this room is not bad at all. That was close. She still doesn't remember anything. She'll get used to it. And then she will think that we really are her parents. Mom, Dad, what's going on here? Ethan, son. We will explain everything. That is what I expect. Who the hell is that young girl? And why did you tell me that she was my sister? She's Violetta, and we are... We adopted her. Now you have a sister. All right. <sighs> hey, parents, are you crazy? Why do you need another child? She's almost an adult. She's 16 years old and so kind. We wanted to adopt her. <sighs> but you should not tell her that she is adopted. She thinks that she's always lived with us. Is she crazy too as you? No. Well, maybe a little bit. Uh, this is all a big mess. But Sam, please wait. Try to support us. Okay. But now you have to let me go to all the parties I want. <laughs> Whatever you want. It's not fair. I 
help Violet when it comes to school. And if not, where do we look for her? Oh, good morning, guys. Susie? Uh, we're glad to see you. Did I hear right? Were you talking about Violetta? And if so, what does it have to do with you? Just wondering. We will be late, but let's go. Let's go. So, Violet is actually missing. This is my chance to take her place. I will be the queen of the school, and I'd better not be late for class. All right, I'm ready. Uh, Violetta, where are you going? What do you mean, I have to go to school? To school? No, you will not go. What are you saying? Uh, Mom and I hired a private teacher, and the doctor made it very clear to us not to let you leave the house. Why not? My friends are there, and besides, I am the queen of the school. It doesn't matter, you still have to wait. You must make a full recovery. I feel fine. No, dear, you're not ready. Listen, Bam, Violet is not coming. What are we going to do? We should place a search warrant. We have to wait three days. Let's go look for her ourselves. Searching for her in this big city will be very difficult. It's true, but we really have no other choice. Oh, hey guys, here you are. It's for you. Um, what is that? The form where you can vote for the queen of the school. I don't understand. The queen was already chosen. be valid. It's very good news. <laughs> so take this. Oh no. If Violetta finds out about it, she will be really angry. We have to find her now. The plan to look for her alone seems to be a good idea. Let's go. Well, I think I'm hungry now. Mm, yeah, only healthy food. It would be nice to eat french fries. What's up, little sister? Ethan, you really scared me. Oh, Back poor bag, girl. Yeah. I didn't mean to. I understood. <sighs> I saw. Down. Back in my bag and I gotta brag. I do this shit for What real. have you done? Uh, uh, I broke a vase. What is going on here? Who broke something? Uh, well, Violetta dropped the vase. And now it's broken. What? Um, Violetta, Ethan, you'd better stop bothering her. Oh, me? I didn't do it. It wasn't me. Um, there's no problem, daughter. We'll buy another new vase. Um, although this one costs us $5,000. Ethan, tell me why you did that. Oh, sorry. I knew mom wasn't going to punish you. Of course. Very clever. Mm. <laughs> My new sister has a really horrible character. Hi. Ben, we've been to 200 houses and Violet is not anywhere. We can't go on. What do we do? Until we go to the police, we gotta ask them to start looking for her. Come on, we have no other choice. <sighs> I'm so bored without seeing my friends. Oh, wait, where is my phone? Daughter, good morning. How are you feeling today, huh? I'm just fine. Actually, now I wanted to ask you... Uh, wait a sec, we have a present for you, dear. A present for me? <laughs> yeah. And what are we celebrating? It's no big deal. We only celebrate the fact that we have an amazing daughter like you. So come on. Oh, wow. That's so cute. Okay, let's see. A new phone? Great. And money. Well, we were thinking that you would need those things. We hoped you enjoy it. Great. But where is my old phone? We already threw it away. You won't need it again. Oh, there were my friend's numbers in there. How am I going to be able to contact them? Well, what do you need them for? You gotta think that you have a great love and family. And that we will always be together. Well, yeah. We already told you she's missing. Or maybe someone kidnapped her. Mm -hmm. <sighs> All right, kids, get out of here. I don't have time for nonsense. I'm busy right now. Important business. <sighs> We're being truly honest, sir. Uh, for real, something must have happened to her. Only after three days we can look for her. Is that actually a joke? Okay, enough. Leave right now or you will end up sleeping in prison. No. Do it. <sighs> kids are so annoying. <sighs> I think my parents are very strange. I don't even have pictures with them. Well, hello, dear sister. Ethan, stop bothering me. How many times will I have to tell you? I can see your parents bought you a new phone. 
Let me play with it. Uh huh. You're not a baby. Get out. I'll take it. Ethan, stop! Come back! Now come and get it. Ethan! <laughs> You'll see. Oh! What's happening? Oh! oh! <laughs> it looks like you fell. <laughs> oh, why did you do that? I could have broken a bone. That didn't happen. Don't complain. Oh, oh, oh. What? Looks like you broke that laptop. I broke it? Are you kidding me? Hey, kids, what's going on here? Uh, well, nothing, everything is fine. Ethan? What is that, my laptop? Uh, yeah, he broke it. What do you think, Dad? Very good. You're grounded. You will not play video games for a week. But Violet actually did it. This is all a big trap. Now it's for two weeks. <laughs> and why did you do that? <laughs> it's all because of you. Did you think I would forget what you did with the vase? Well, no. And give me my phone. Well, we'll soon see who's smarter, dear sister. Right, the house that comes next is this one. Sure, let's go take a look. Come on. Oh, wow, this is a huge house. It seems that they're millionaires. I hope Violetta is here. Good morning. I'll be very clear. No one in the house wants to buy your cookies. See you later. Uh, one second. We came for other reasons. We're looking for a girl. Her name is Violetta. A few days have passed and we cannot find her. Maybe you have seen her. No, I honestly don't know any girl with that name. See you later. What a rude woman. Don't even say so. All right, let's keep looking. That was too close. I hope those kids don't come back here anymore. I won't let Violetta see them. Mom, I thought there was someone who knocked on the door. Daughter, it was only a messenger that came to deliver a package. Oh, I get it. Wait, uh, and where's the package? Oh, they got the wrong address. Now they went to the right house. Uh-huh, all right. Oh, wait, Mom! Um, what? I just wanted to say thanks again for the new phone. It's amazing. Oh, it's nothing, dear. Okay, one more day and we can go see the police. Well, I don't think they're going to help us. Well, we'll see about that. Oh my gosh! Oh, good morning. Didn't you expect to see me dressed like this? I'm just preparing for my role. Yeah. Nobody expected to see something like that. No problem, because now the queen of the school will be me. I'm about to get that title now. Bye-bye. She was real quick to take Violetta's place. Don't even say it. We have to find her. It's time to teach you a lesson, sister. Yeah. Tea with salt. And even better, some pepper. That's perfect. Oh, hello. What are you doing? Nothing. I was drinking tea. I would like some too. No problem. You can have mine. I can't believe it. Why are you being so nice to me? Now I will prepare one for myself. Okay. Oh, Ethan, what the hell is this? <laughs> it's what you deserve for what you did to me. You know what, Ethan? This will not end like this. Why does she get so angry? It's just tea. With salt and pepper. <laughs> this phone no longer works. Oh, can you believe it? Violetta's friends came looking for her. They're the ones that came to the crown ceremony. Seriously? And did they see her? No, I told them to leave right away. Oh... Everything could have been ruined. That is what I thought so too. We can't lock her up for much longer. Don't worry, we'll think of something. And I'm very happy that we finally have a girl. This is what we always want. And she will stay with us forever. That I can assure you. Uh, I honestly can stand Ethan. I can't believe I have such a dumb brother. I have to make a good prank on him. Oh, I think I have a good idea. 
Well, Dad already told me all about the gym at home. And also Ethan comes often to train here. He normally wears boxing gloves. I think I'm going to help him out a bit with his boxing session. Where are they? Oh, yes, here they are. Now I'm going to teach you, dear sister. I have to get my parents to kick her out of her house and soon. Well, where are my mom's designer dresses? Oh, here they are. Well, I have to figure out how to screw it up. <laughs> hey, I haven't exercised in a long time. <laughs> where do I begin? Oh, box. It's gonna be perfect. Huh, I'll wear the gloves. <laughs> Now let's work out. Well, boxing is not my thing. Hey, hey, it's not working. I can't get them out. <laughs> this is very funny. Oh no, there's no more popcorn. I have to go get some more. How are you? Where are you going? What the hell do you care? I'll go get some popcorn. Bring some for me. Get away from me. Uh, I really can't stand her. Uh, who did this? Uh. <laughs> Tell me, Dad. Are you boxing now? Ethan, now I'm not joking. Someone put glue inside my gloves. Oh, Dad, what's wrong? Did you go to the gym? Well, yeah, it's the first time I go in a month, and this is what happens. Dad, I actually did that. Ethan? But why? Why do you make these silly jokes, huh? That's just because I have small hands and the gloves are too big. I use glue to make them fit me well. Ethan, sometimes you manage to surprise me with your foolishness. Ah! Tell me who did this! What's wrong, my dear? Tell me right now who ruined my favorite dress! Well, I... I did it! I was drinking, uh, milk and I spilled some on the dress. I hope it's not a big problem. <laughs> Violetta, well, don't worry. We'll go shopping together very soon. Amazing! Sam, why are you wearing boxing gloves now? Well... It's a long story. I have to think of how to get them out. Uh, maybe some oil will help. I've seen it in a movie. Of course. Let's try it now. <laughs> I think the kids are not being very friendly. We have to do something. It doesn't matter. It won't be long before Violetta believes that she really is our daughter. What? Violetta? Interesting. Do you actually think so? The good thing is that she has never seen her friends again. Mm, we have to think of a plan, if she ever sees her friends. It's true. I love you very much, dear. And I love you. <sighs> it turns out that they kidnapped Violetta. Very well, that is good for me. I'll continue to be queen and Violetta's not going to bother me. And those fools Emma and Ben will keep so looking for her. Good. <laughs> Violetta, I didn't expect you to cover for me. Honestly, neither did I. By the way, I'm sorry. I set you up with mom's dress. And I'm sorry for the gloves. I thought you were going to wear them. <laughs> yeah, I thought so. Forget it. It's okay. Listen, uh, tell me more about my parents. I can only remember things from my school life. Well, they're millionaires and they can afford to have whatever they want. Well, I think that's everything you should know. But I already understood that. They even have a private gym here. Listen, you told me you don't remember anything. Yes, I suffered a great blow during my coronation. Whoa, I'm glad you're okay now. Uh, I have to leave now. See you later. Yes, very good. <laughs> oh no, I really miss Emma and Ben. <sighs> And lessons are just starting. I just want to go see them. I have to leave the house without my parents noticing. But how will I do it? Maybe I could use the window. All right. Ah, perfect. Now I have to find out the address of the school. Now just look at this beautiful dress that I bought for Violetta at this store. Isn't it beautiful? 
Oh, really? You always choose right, dear. I had always dreamed of a daughter like Violetta. Now we can go shopping together. <sighs> mm-hmm. What matters is that Ethan can never find out that we kidnapped Violetta. Come on, how would he find out? Everything will be fine. I'm going to keep this dress here. Oh my god. Right after school, we'll go to the police. Uh, I already prepared some missing person posters. What's up, you guys? Susie, hello. How's the search for Violetta going? Mm, honestly, not well. Listen, what does that matter to you? You don't even talk to her. I just thought you might need my help. Even though we're not the best of friends, I feel a little sorry. Well... What? Are the guys talking with Susie? Are they friends? I can't believe it. <gasps> Did you hear that? No, I haven't heard anything. Me neither. Maybe you imagined it. Maybe. Listen, Susie, if you want to help with something, please share these posters. That will help. Only if you don't mind. Um, alright. Maybe I will see you soon. What happened to her? I don't know. Maybe she really wants to stop being kind now. I don't believe that. Ethan, what's going on? I have a very urgent matter to tell you. I discovered something. Tell me what is it about. You could have been more careful. I'm sorry. Listen, I was about to enter into a wardrobe and you know what I heard? Well, what did you hear? I had always dreamed of a daughter like Violetta. Now we can go shopping together. <sighs> mm -hmm. What matters is that Ethan can never find out that we kidnapped Violetta. Come on, how could he find out? Everything will be fine. I'm going to keep this dress here. Oh my god. So yeah, I heard that. What? How come they kidnapped me? So they are not actually my real parents? I don't think so. They even told me that they adopted you. It's not true. How did something like this happen? And why didn't you tell me this before? I don't know. I'm also shocked. Come on, let's take care of this. But please wait. What are you going to tell them? I'll think about it. Or maybe I should go to the police? Oh no, not the police. After all, they're my parents. All right, we have to think about how to solve it. Come on. Good morning. <sighs> Once again? How many times will you bother me? You're a policeman, and we have the right to come here. It's been three days. You have to start looking for our friends right now. <sighs> All right, guys. Write up the statement. We'll look into it, and then we no. will... You must go look for her right now. <sighs> now I can't help you, kids. Well, leave already. Ben, let's go. <sighs> How about... Like this. Ah, I was just thinking that I have... A lot of time, and I'm gonna take care of looking for your friend. <laughs> That's really good. Now I'm leaving. I have to take care of looking for your friend. Ben, where'd you get that money from? I was saving to buy a new console, but we have to help Violetta. You're so great. I think they're in the living room. Come on. I was actually looking at a new bathtub. It's amazing. Hello there. Oh, Violetta, Ethan, where were you guys? Violetta, I said that you still haven't recovered. You can't walk down the street yet. The truth is that I feel better than ever. Is it just me or you're a little angry? It's what I feel. Can you actually explain to me why you kidnapped me? Uh, Violetta, no. We just adopted you. You are awful liars. I heard everything. And you also told me not to tell Violetta about the adoption. Uh-huh, you thought about everything. Daughter, it's all a big misunderstanding. All just a misunderstanding? You are crazy. You brought me to your house and you told me that I was your daughter. Well, we just wanted to give you a family. I don't need a family and much less one with you. Violetta! Please wait. We need to talk. Violetta! We finally found you. <laughs> Hey guys, I'm very happy to see you. All right, I promise I'll help you find your friend, didn't I? Thank you so much. Violetta, did you call him? No, it wasn't me, seriously. Well, it seems that you kidnapped the girl. Uh, hey! 
Uh, wait there, he didn't do it. They are the ones who kidnapped me. Um, no, 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 it's not true. Uh, we did not do anything. Well, yeah, everyone says so. Start walking. <laughs> Hold on, it's time to make a deal. We're millionaires. It's time to start walking. <laughs> yeah, Violetta, we were very worried about you. Yeah, I felt like you were lost and that we had to go looking for you. Hey, guys, thank you. You are the so best much. friends in the whole world. It's like mm -mm. I've got no sense uh, by the way, guys, listen, he's my brother, or he's not my brother. Listen, this is Ethan. How are you? I'm glad to meet you. Me too. And now we can all be good friends. This is all great, but we still have bad news for you. Don't scare me like that. What's wrong, guys? Susie wants to be the queen of the school, and soon the new coronation will begin. What? The queen of the school? It's not me? No, I'm not gonna let that happen. We will go too. I'm also coming with you. It's finally time. Well, hello, Susie. What? You didn't expect to see me again? Violetta! How did you get here? You were kidnapped. And luckily, I am back. And the queen title is still mine. But that's not fair. I should be the new queen of the school. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> she deserves it. So now we know she's not kind. She said she was trying to help us. And I really thought she wanted to be nice. I didn't like her from the start. <laughs> hey guys, how about we all go to the cafe? Let's go, but before that, I have to do something else. For sure. Oh, I can't believe it. Our son hasn't come to visit us. And not even once. <sighs> and I was totally right. For that reason, I wanted to have a daughter. She would visit us. I'm sure she would even have saved us. If we had a daughter, we would never have kidnapped Violetta. Oh, oh, this was a big mistake. That is true. Oh, dear son. You're here, guys. Yes, I'm not alone. How are you? I'm Violetta. Forgive us. It's all right. I already told the police to let you out right away. Really? Oh, you're very kind. And we're a big mess. Parents, why didn't you tell me everything from the start? Because we didn't know how to explain it and how you guys were going to take it. It will be better not to speak about it. I just hope you guys never try something like that again. Uh, we won't. We promise. Perfect. Now the cops are coming and Violetta and I are leaving. <laughs> Why is everything like this? I just wanted to be able to beat Violetta and she showed up at the worst possible moment. And as always, I was left without the crown. <laughs> Maybe we should calm her down? What for? It's all her fault. I feel sorry. Let's go. Hey, guys, did you come here to make fun of me? Oh, well, I don't think so. Susie, don't cry. It's only a silly crown, really. But I really wanted to get the crown. And what did you want for it? Just show it off. Uh-huh. She only wanted it to make fun of Violetta. Well, that is it. You two should really talk. I know you could become friends without holding grudges. I wonder what Violetta would say about that. I think she would actually agree. All right, Susie, do you accept? All right, I agree. The truth is that I have no friends. Uh -huh. And that is because of you. Emma, Emma, Emma. Uh, well, it looks like we've all become good friends. Hey, bartender, please bring three cocktails. Why are Ethan and Violetta taking so long? Well, I'm glad it's all over. And you don't hold a bit of a grudge? Of course not. I've always lived on campus. At least I got a taste of the millionaire life. And how was it? It was cool. You can afford everything you want. That's true. Listen, I don't want to go with the guys. Why is that? We should go for a walk together. We're not actually brother and sister. Well, you're right about that. Oh, there's going to be a storm. Let's run! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, where is the taxi? How much longer do we have to wait? Uh, uh, I'm tired. Daughter, keep running. I don't want to be late. Mom, I'm sick of being poor. Why do we have to run all the time? No time to talk right now. Just keep running. 
I don't want to wait anymore. I just really want to go shopping. Those were actually my new gifts. Are those two girls crazy? Dad! Oh, please excuse me. It was an accident. Do you know how much they cost? Mom! Dad! Now I need new gifts! Daughter, we have already spent too much money buying them for you. Emma, um, uh, those are things that can be washed. Are you kidding me? Then don't expect to see me wearing any of these dirty clothes ever. Uh, daughter, wait for us. Uh, <laughs> She's a really spoiled girl. That's a shame. I think I've already seen her somewhere. Turn around now. All right, on the other side. Ah, so beautiful. Thank you, Ethan. In fact, I already know that. <laughs> Emma, I made your favorite desserts. I hope you like them. Let me try them. Ben, are you crazy or what? What's going on? It doesn't even have a bit of gold. I will never eat something like this. Ooh. Oh. Why did you do that? We both tried very hard. Uh-huh. You are both doing very badly. Wow, this is such a cool place. Who on earth are you? Get out of here, loser. Hey! <laughs> hey, daughter, what are you thinking about? Let's go. I'm sorry, Mom, but I have more important things to do now. Bye. Hey, daughter, where are you going now? And where are we now? <sighs> I'm so tired. I think it's time for relaxing masks, my dear. Oof. Hey, parents! Get up now! We have to go get the other set of gifts for me! These people don't live badly at all. What? Do you really want new gift? But we already bought you so many. Yeah, but now they are all dirty! I don't want to feel humiliated by wearing that! Uh, Sam, give her some money so she can go by herself and buy whatever she wants. <sighs> all right. Take it. This is all? Thank you, Dad. Now I can clearly see that you really don't love me at all. I think she's a little too spoiled. I think that's true. I totally agree with you. Oh my gosh. <sighs> I can't believe it. How can you actually treat your own daughter like this? Oh, wow. One hundred dollars! This is really a lot of money! I can buy so many things with this, and Emma's so spoiled! I think I already have a plan! Hmm. Well, I'm going to buy this dress... and this one. <laughs> That's enough! I won't be able to carry all this! I have the money to buy everything here, and I am the daughter of a millionaire, so you will have to carry everything. All right, I understand. And you, Ben, here. Go and pay. Do I have to grab everything from the ground now? Oh, no. Good morning, I'm looking for Emma. Does anyone know her? It's me. Tell me, what do you want? I work in an important modeling agency and we want to offer you a job for a big commercial. Hmm, no, I'm not interested. On Instagram, I have enough followers and fans. Right, guys? Of course. You should really think about it because we offer you a million dollars. One million dollars? Does that really mean I could be almost as rich as my parents? All right, tell me the place and the time and I'll be there. Well, here we are. Mm, yeah, honestly, it's kind of a weird place to record a big commercial. Well, it wasn't my decision and for a million dollars you should tolerate it. Okay, as you say, what should I do now? Just get inside this cage and put on that vest over there. <sighs> it's a very horrible outfit for a commercial. Hey, I don't get it. It is now your new home. Get used to this place, silly millionaire. Bye-bye. <sighs> hey, let me out of here now. Come back. Hey! Ah, <sighs> great. Finally, we have a moment to rest in peace, darling. And when she's not there, it's quiet. No one's asking for money. You're the third, sir. Thank you so much.
Are you kidding me? These are actually disgusting. I don't see an ounce of gold. You must bring new ones. Ah, <sighs> well, am I just like your own mother? <laughs> I don't understand. Hey, little girl, what's wrong with you? I'm so sorry to bother you, but I don't have anywhere else to go. Poor little girl, is there anything we can do to help you? There's nothing you can do. My mother abandoned me, and now I'm completely alone, and I don't have anyone anymore. That's so sad. You know what? I do have one request. Can I stay with you, please? I can make food and clean whatever you ask me to, please. In fact, we already have employees for all that. <laughs> I guess you could stay with us for a while. Would you mind, Violetta? Well, of course I don't mind, dear. Uh, thank you. <laughs> okay, Susie, come inside. This will be your new room. Whoa. <laughs> this is the best bed I've ever been in. By the way, there is a big wardrobe here. If you want, you can choose something to wear. You're very kind, thank you. If you want to eat something, you can ask whatever you want to our personal chef. Burgers, lobsters, caviar, steaks, anything you want. It's incredible. Well, yeah, if you need money, you can get it from there. Bye-bye. Awesome, now I'll pick out a new dress. I think this is perfect for me. I'm beautiful and no longer poor. Now a new and amazing life awaits me. Oh, poor they. Hello there. Hello. Uh, where's Emma? Emma's far away from here. She moved. Oh, wow. Why didn't she tell us about that? Well, let's go, Ethan. What? I think it would be good for us to get to know each other. I think you're cute. Come here. Come on, guys. <laughs> well, you are quite pretty. Ethan, come on. My plan is working. <laughs> Someone has to open this gate. How can I get out of here now? <sighs> My third job of the day. I'm really tired. Hey, poor fool. You really scared me. Are you talking to me? Is there another poor in here? Help me get out of here, please. No, I honestly don't want any trouble. I don't even know why you're locked up. I was locked up in here by a very annoying homeless girl, and now I don't know how to get out. What? Oh, uh, really? I'm serious. If you help me get out of here, I'm going to pay you thousands of dollars. Whoa, I can't believe it. I'll help you. Oh, here it is. Okay, how much longer? Just wait, I'll get you out. By the way, with the money I'm going to give you, buy normal clothes. That outfit you're wearing is awful. What? I'm just trying to help, and you're just telling me that my outfit is ugly? Now I won't help you, do you understand? Hey, don't leave. It was just a joke. Oh no, what am I gonna do? <sighs> Oh, I won't wait any longer. Girls, come eat. Violetta, where is her daughter? She should have finished the photo session by now. I'm going to call her right now. The number That's you dialed weird. is her not phone available. Is turned Try off. later. What if something happened to her? Shall we go to the police? Good morning. I just found this letter and it was in the front door. It looks like it's from Emma. I hate you. Don't wait for me at home. You won't see me again. What a nightmare. How could she do something like that? We have already fought so many times, but I did not expect this at all. You know, I am sure she will be back when the money on her cards runs out. <sighs> at least she's going to see what life is really like. Well, don't you worry anymore. And, you know, I honestly think you're really amazing parents. I want to hug you now. <laughs> so sweet. Thank you, darling. Okay, Susie, sit down. Let's eat. 
let's talk about what you want to buy, which university you want to go to next, and all that stuff. Cool, all right. Ethan, I need to talk to you. Ethan, hey! Huh? What? <sighs> Why are you so thoughtful? What do you have in mind? <sighs> well. <sighs> Listen, it doesn't matter. Uh, do you know where Emma could have possibly gone to? No, but I just hope she doesn't bother us anymore. Hello, guys. Hello. I just wanted to ask you if you want to go to a party tonight. I want to go. Yeah, for sure. Perfect. I'll see you guys later then. You saw that? She sent me an air kiss. Hey, actually that kiss was for me. I like her and I know she's going out with me. Alright, we'll see about that. Okay, Susie, go ahead. This is our exclusive dressing room and wardrobe. Wow. You can go and choose a lot of beautiful outfits for each day. It's amazing. I've never been in a place like this. Daughter, choose everything you want. Great, thank you. I want this, this, and also this. <laughs> Give them to me. I'll hold them. All right. I want the most expensive thing. Oh, can I also take this cute purse too? Of course you can, daughter. You're the best parents ever. And you, you are the best daughter. By the way, mom, dad, can I invite my friends over? I was thinking of having a party. Well, all right. So now I have to choose an outfit for tonight. Well, this is cute. Hmm? Sus is starting to remind me of someone else. Mm -hmm. I'm coming, I'm coming. Hello, Susie. Why are you so early? The party starts in a few hours. Uh, I wanted to come a little earlier, and I also wanted to give you this. The I'm in love with a friend book? Hmm, mm, a very interesting book. You should read it. The main character is similar to me, and the other one to you. That's very sweet. Thank you, Ben. Come inside. Susie. She kissed me. <laughs> yeah, what a gift. I wonder who that might be. Hello, beautiful. Ethan, I'm very happy to see you. I think you'll be even happier when you see the gift that I brought just for you. An exclusive brand bag? I've always dreamed of this. Awesome, thank you. And that's it? Oh, I'm sorry, I almost forgot. All right, that's better. Come inside, let's get ready for the party now. As you say, beautiful. I can't believe two cute guys like me. Which one should I choose? I'll think about it. <sighs> Very good. I put up the last announcements, now I can go. Well, I need to look for more job openings. Oh no, it's not possible. I'm sorry, can we talk for a second? Yes, I will listen to you carefully. Um, which one of these jobs is the highest paid? I want to save to buy my daughter a new phone. <laughs> well, you could work as a maid in the houses of millionaires, but I don't think they would hire you. And um, why is that? Well, your appearance does not fit with the status of those families, but for a good price, I'm willing to help you. <sighs> um, but I don't have any money. <gasps> no money, then no deal. Um, wait a second, you don't have any kids? No. Well, I do have one, a daughter, and she really wants a new phone. Could you help me? I'm begging you. Don't look at me that way. Please, 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 please. All right, but I'm not buying you a new outfit. I'm just going to help you. Thank you. Let's go. Ah, <sighs> uh, well, come inside. This is our living room. Wow. This is a really big house. Uh, yes, it's one of the best in the city. <gasps> is this girl in the photo your daughter? Well, yeah. Please don't touch my cell phone. 
her face looks familiar to me. Uh, she no longer lives in this house. We decided to adopt another girl, and now you're going to clean her room. Did you adopt another girl? Yeah, that's right. Her own mother kicked her out of the house. Can you believe that? That's terrible. Poor girl. I wouldn't wish anything like this on anyone. I agree. Now you will see her room, and then you will get to meet her. Susie, are you up for a joke? All right. Uh, uh, uh. Now try to get them. Give me back my glasses. I can't see anything without them. Where are you? Uh. Ouch. <laughs> Ethan, what did you do that to him? Now he's gonna look for his glasses and will not bother us. Shall we dance? Alright, Ethan, can you please just tell me one thing? Do you really like me enough? I've always liked this kind of girl. Those who are stylish, beautiful, and rich. So that means I'm the perfect girl for you? I've been trying for days to make you notice that I really like you. And I also like you a lot. Susie! Oh no, it looks like my mom's coming. Hello, mom. Could you come for a second? I need you to meet someone now. Of course, I'll go. Hey guys, don't get bored here. I'll be back soon. Susie, help me find my glasses. Hey! Oh. <laughs> ben, you're like a poor little mouse. What did you say? <laughs> oh. oh, this is a really beautiful room. I really think Susie would have loved it. <sighs> uh, daughter, now you're going to have a personal maid just for you. Oh, really? Thank you, Mom. That's so amazing. And now you are going to meet her. Of course. <sighs> Mom? Um, no, I really don't want to meet her. And why is that? That poor woman. I don't like her. She looks very responsible. Honey, don't talk nonsense. She's responsible. I personally took care of it myself. In fact, right now I have a lot of things to do and at the moment I can't meet her, so bye-bye. Hey, where are you going? Oh, uh, well, when is your daughter coming over? I would really like to meet her. I don't know. She said she had to do something very important right now. <sighs> That's a pity. Okay, I'll have to wait then. <sighs> oh, I hate doing night shift. Now that no one's here, it's my time to sleep. Ugh. <sighs> <sighs> Why is it so uncomfortable now? Mm, what's going on? Ah! Ah! Who the heck are you? What are you doing here? I could ask the same question to you! I actually work here every day. And I'm stuck in here thanks to a crazy girl! Stop! Do you work here? Well, yes. I am finally free! Hey, where are you going? Now I have to do something really important. Thank you for your help! Oh no, it looks like my bosses are going to fire me. What am I going to do? If I wouldn't have lost my glasses, the party would have been a lot more fun. I don't know about you, but Susie and I really had a great time, actually. Ethan, this is all because of you. Is it my fault that you have bad luck? Yeah, this is all your fault. It's not my fault. You took my glasses. I didn't you take did them. it. You took Stop my glasses. Stop bothering me. Everything's ah, your fault. Now you'll see. I'm gonna smash you. Hey, guys, stop fighting. Susie, what's up? Do you know how many more parties we're going to have? Stop it already. Susie, I'm really happy to have met you. Hey, nerd. I think I would not be so brave in your place. First, I'm not a nerd. And second, what are you gonna do to me? If you want to know, I'll show you. All right, all right. That's enough. <sighs> Hello, guys. I'm back. Emma? Yes, yes, it's me. Once again, you can admire me. Listen, it seems you're a little late. You? What are you doing here? Oh, oh, oh no. I replaced you as the most popular girl here and daughter of millionaires. Nobody wants you here anymore. And who do you think you are? Do you think you can have my life? A 
All right, I'm going to teach you. Ben, Ethan, get out of here. Uh, right away. Hey, don't touch me! What are you doing? It's me, Emma! Oh! Emma, I will always be better than you. And it seems that now I took over your life. Now I only have to deal with my real mother. We have to organize and talk about the next month's budget. Okay, we need to save $10,000 for Susie's clothes. Oh, that must be her. <laughs> now we'll talk to her about this. <gasps> Mom! Dad! I am home! Emma? Emma? I have missed you so much! Hey, what? Aren't you glad to see me? Well, after the things you did to us, no, not much. What are you saying? What things did I do? You left home and you fall for money. This is not how we raised you. What are you talking about? Now I will tell you the story of what really happened to me. Emma, we've been through this before. First, you say that we're the worst parents of all. And then when you want something new, you start apologizing for everything. What? What do you mean? <sighs> it's time for you to grow up now and think about your actions. That's right. Mom, Dad, a poor girl set me up and locked me inside of a cage. I couldn't come back home. Couldn't you make up something better? I am really telling the truth. I swear that I am. Sam, I think it's time for us to talk somewhere else. It's a good idea. Let's go, my darling. Oh, yeah? Does it mean you don't even care? I really don't need parents who are like you. <sighs> This is a big bathroom and also beautiful. It's not like bathing with water from the street or waiting for the rain. <sighs> Mom, are you still here? Oh no, now I have to do something or soon my whole plan will be ruined. Oh, Susie, you're home? Yeah, Dad, I think I really need to talk to you right now. Uh, daughter, don't scare me like that. Listen, this new maid... A criminal. What? Listen, early she was cleaning my room and then I also found out I was missing over a thousand dollars and the dress you guys gave me a few days ago. Uh, are you sure? I think Britney doesn't seem to be a criminal. Well, why would I be lying to you? In fact, I don't really need a maid. I can do everything by myself. Then what should we do? Fire her? Of course. Please, Dad. Hmm. Since you're asking, I'll do it. I'm sorry, Mommy. This is best for everyone. No, 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 no. Brittany. Um, yeah, Mr. Sam? I had a talk with my daughter, and she's not happy with your work. You're fired. Um, what do you mean? Am I fired? Yes, you must leave right away. Um, what's the reason? You just hired me, sir. I don't want any more questions. You must go. <gasps> I'm serious now. Please go. Oh, yeah. This is the best feeling ever. Hey, nerd! Oh, great. You gotta stop doing that. Hey, what? What are you saying? Stop thinking about Susie. Uh, I wasn't doing that. What are you talking about? I know it. You were imagining how you would spend time with her. Oh, and also about kissing her, right? Okay, Ethan, stop it. How can you read my mind? You nerds are so predictable. When you see a pretty girl, you just fall in love. How many times will I tell you that I'm not a nerd? And maybe you should accept that I will be the one dating Susie, huh? Uh-huh. And don't even dream of it. It's not possible. Well, you could go out with Emma. She's also a very good option. No. If you want, you can keep her. And I'll be with Susie. Well, you always liked rich girls. So you really shouldn't care about who it is. Well, now I'm in love. And Susie is mine. She is mine. Nerd, you're pissing me off. I'm going to hurt you. <laughs> if I have done something wrong, I beg you to forgive me, please. There is no problem. I'm totally sure you'll find a very good job really soon. The truth is that I do this for my own daughter. She has always dreamed about living like rich people. Yeah, this life is really great. And if you ever need a maid again, please just let me know. Of course we will. Um, 
by the way, could I borrow your phone? I need to call my daughter because of work. I couldn't see or talk to her for weeks now. <sighs> yes, of course. Here you go. Thank you. Mommy? Oh no, such bad timing. Did you also hear that? What? Nothing, don't you worry, I surely imagined it. Oh no, she's not answering, she must be busy. Okay, thank you very much, see you later. Have a nice day. Hello, is there anyone here? All right, I'm going to stay here. Maybe after a while my parents will realize that they were wrong about me. Daughter, are you home? You? What are you doing here? Me? Well, really, it's nothing. But tell me, this is your house, right? Actually, yeah. Listen, without your help, I managed to get out of prison, and I have nowhere to live now. Can I stay with you? I beg you. I would love to, but there is only enough room for me and my daughter. You have a daughter? Yeah, but I can't locate her, and I'm very worried about where she might be. I wish I had a mother like that, who cared and worried about me. We have a great relationship. Oh, now I'll show you a photo. Actually, she's really beautiful. <sighs> oh, what? Is that your daughter? Well, yeah, this is my Susie. Why are you upset? She was the one who locked me up in prison, and now she's living in my own house. What are you saying? I am telling you the truth, really. I don't know. My sister just wants to be with me. I will show you. <sighs> That's a lot of work. Honey, we really need to have a serious talk. Darling, just hurry up. I have a lot of work to do. Susie has already prepared a shopping list and wrote down what she urgently needs. How much is this? $100,000? Well, after all, she's our little daughter now. Don't you think we're spending too much on her, huh? I do not know, dear. I don't think I can spend a hundred thousand dollars on what she wants. I have to invest in another business. But darling, don't you remember how much we spent on Emma? Anyway, it was much less than this. I think Susie is taking advantage of the fact that we are millionaires. And what do you mean by that? We trust her way too soon, you understand? Mm, I don't know, maybe it's true. You have to tell her that we're not going to spend this amount of money on her purchases. All right. After that, I will take you to Bali, or better yet, to the Maldives. Hooray! That's my dream! Avoid the Maldives. We can go for a walk in the park. It's gonna be fun, and I could read you some poems. Well, that's another option. I understand, man. You don't have normal clothes to go to the beach, and you prefer to stay here. It's not that. I don't care about money. I care about spending time together. And like you. What did you say? <laughs> <laughs> Enough, you guys. If you guys don't want to go to the Maldives, then let's just choose another place, okay? No, Susie. Instead of a place, you should choose a boyfriend. Boyfriend? Are you talking about you or Ben? Just remember, Susie, I like you as a person, not as a walking purse. Hey, guys, you're both great. I really don't know who to choose. Hello again, everybody. You again? I already told you that you were no longer welcome here. I already know that. Now I can only accept my defeat, Susie. Are you serious? Yes, I have decided to leave school. But before that, I will have a farewell party. Are you coming? Uh, of course we will. I still don't know. All right, but only because you will leave this place. Perfect. I'll be waiting for all of you then. Now we have to talk to Susie about the money. I hope she understands. We'll see how she reacts after hearing that. Hello again, parents. How are you today? Emma, what are you doing here? We're both fine. I came to ask you how your new daughter is doing, the one that you replaced me with. And how do you even know we adopted that girl? Well, that's not important right now. I want to tell you the whole truth about her. If you're going to lie to us again, we don't want to listen to you anymore. Wait, darling. I think Emma's going to tell the truth this time. Now you just have to wait a little bit longer. What kind of dress code is this? Why did I come to the party blindfolded? Thank you, guys. 
Susie, you can take off the blindfold. It was about time. I don't understand. That's right. I don't understand what's going on either. Emma, what is this circus? Susie, could you please tell my mom how you ended up in this house? Well, it was all because my mother kicked me out of my house. Did your mother kick you out of the house or did you run away yourself? Mom? What? What, what mom? mom? Oh, yes, that's right. Brittany is Susie's real mother and she hasn't kicked her out of the house. You're disgusting. You don't get to say that. Susie, we need an explanation now. Well, okay. I just wanted to have a rich family, that's all. Mm-hmm. The truth is that she's very poor and you guys believed her too. Oh, Susie, I can't believe you did something like that to your mom. Then you can keep her. I don't like her. Well, no, thank you. I actually can't date people who lie. You should have realized that you put me through a lot of embarrassment. We were a family and you only care about money. No, Mom, wait for me, please! So, parents, what do you think? Yeah, this is not a pretty situation. How could she possibly fool everyone like that? Can you see? I was telling the truth. <sighs> Daughter, do you want us to buy you a new car? No, that's not enough. Or a yacht, whatever you want. Or maybe a plane or a house. What do you want? <laughs> Mom, please wait! <laughs> what do you want, Susie? I do understand that I was wrong, but I won't do something like that again. Forgive me, please. You're only saying that because that girl rattled you out. No, honestly, this rich life was starting to get boring. And I was planning to come home soon. Really? Of course, you have to forgive me. You're the best mother in the world. And you're the best daughter of all. <laughs> oh, Mom, are you okay? Mommy, I'm so sorry. Forgive me. I didn't want this to happen. Daughter, don't worry. It's not your fault. Mom, what, what will we do without you? My girls, don't you worry. Just take care of each other. You know how to do everything. I believe in you. Mom. All right, girls, that's it. Your time's up. Get out of here. Hey, Mom, I'll get you out of here. I'll get all the money back, I promise. Mommy, no! <laughs> no. Oh. Now this is what I call a great party. Well, now it's my turn to spin the bottle. Mm. Ethan, come here. I'm going to give you a kiss. Wait, Layla. Hey, guys, hello. Um, can I join and play with you? Susie, hello. It's so nice to see you. What are you doing here, poor girl? Actually, you weren't even invited to our party. Well, it's just that I really wanted to spend some time in good company. Come on, it's fine. Let her stay. It'll be more fun. All right. Oh, um, can it be my turn to spin the bottle? Of course, go on. Susie, spit in. <laughs> Who should I kiss? <laughs> well, poor girl, it seems you'll have to go kiss the door. You should do it from the other side so you can get out of here right after that. Hey, girls, hold on. Just let me do it again. Come on. Why oh, doesn't anyone want to be friends with poor people? That is not fair. <laughs> All right, shall we continue? Why did you do that to her? She doesn't belong here like we do. It's common sense. All right, let's forget about her and keep playing this game. Daughter, enjoy your meal. Mom, thanks for the food. Even if it's not expensive, it's really good. I'm sick of everyone. Daughter, what's wrong with you? Did someone hurt you? No, Mom, tell me, why are we so poor? Well, it's just that things are like that. It's not our fault. Uh-huh, for sure. It's not our fault. Why are we eating this again? It's what mom can afford. You should appreciate it. I only had money to buy that, honey. Maybe you don't want to earn money like everyone else. Susie, don't yell at mom. She works her back off every day just for us. Of course, she just works for us to eat awful food. I'm tired. 
why is she like that? I actually have three jobs, and it's only enough to bring you food. Mom, don't listen to her. Our family is going through a difficult period. It will pass. Everything will be fine. I really hope so, my daughter. <laughs> 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 Now you'll see my master serve. Shut up now and prove it. All right. <sighs> Ethan is so handsome. My friend, go on and talk to him. <sighs> Ethan, hello. Uh, can we talk? Uh, Layla, we're playing. Don't interrupt. But Ethan. <sighs> Layla, be careful. <gasps> oh, my head hurts. Take it oh. easy, Layla. Oh no, you shouldn't have interrupted the game. And you should have been more careful. Ow. You better get out of here. But... Get up, my friend. <laughs> oh, great. Ethan didn't even give me a hand. How am I supposed to make him notice me? <laughs> Susie, stop being mean like that to mom. Well, why should I do that? It's actually her fault that we don't have money. Well, why are you saying that? Well, since we're so poor, I don't have any friends. We have to think of something to become rich. I just had a very good idea. Tuzi, don't you dare talk about Grandma's jewelry. You know it has emotional value to Mom. Oh my gosh. Hey, hey are you really thinking of selling that jewelry? Just to buy us a fancy house? Uh-huh. Just leave it. Little sister, don't you understand that if we don't sell them soon, they will lose all the real value later? Oh, you're so ungrateful, Susie. Mom does what she can, and you don't appreciate it. I could become actually very rich today, and you would still be pathetic and poor. Um, I should sell everything. I'm sorry, Grandma, but I need it for my happiness. <sighs> Hello, I'm here. I'm waiting for you. In fact, me too. Oh, good day, sir. Good morning. Give me your jewelry, quickly. I have to go. Uh-huh. Um, where is it? Hey, girl, why is it taking so long? Um, yes, here it is. Um, how much do you think they're worth? Well, I don't think they have much value, you know? Just give me all that you can. I really need the money. Uh, okay. Will this be enough for you? It's actually a lot more than I hoped for. Very good. If you have more to sell, please let me know. Yeah, it's a deal. Um, I really can't believe all of this is mine. Great! Oh, Susie, hello. What a nice surprise. Ben, hello. Um, would you like to go get a coffee? Or to the movies? Or to shopping? Well, sounds good to me. I will be able to pay for everything. I have a lot of money now. <laughs> No, you don't have to pay all by yourself, but we could go to the movies. Okay, let's go. Oh, this job is really exhausting. I have to clean the floors and I'm done. Maybe I can get a little more money. Hey girls, can you let me clean here? I really have to finish. Hmm. <laughs> Foo, your dirty mop just touched my feet. What a mess. How do they let low-class people work in a school like this? I'm actually cleaning here. All right, I'd better finish this later then. <laughs> Brittany, look, she's got holes all over her. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that. I think it looks much better that way. <laughs> hey, girls, why are you doing this to me? <laughs> Get away from my mother right now or I'll use this broom to hit you. <laughs> Whoa, calm down, calm down. Let's go now, Layla. We don't want to be associated with these poor and pathetic people. <laughs> Daughter, your school has really horrible students. Mommy, don't listen to them. They're not worth it. And besides, those were Susie's classmates. I just hope my dear daughter isn't friends with those mean girls. I really don't like them at all. Well, it's Susie, so they're surely friends, you know. Emma, Susie is a very nice and good girl, although she hasn't been in a good mood lately. Whatever. All right, let's just get this over with. Ugh. Oh no, I don't understand. Why isn't my makeup looking good as always today? Um, maybe the planets weren't aligned? Have you read your horoscope today? Mm, today I haven't read it yet. Oh god! Hey girls, I have something nice for you. 
didn't they teach you to knock the door first? Of course, but you better see what I bought for you. All, All right. right. Unbelievable, <gasps> there are really nice things here. <laughs> Look at this, masks and makeup. Great. Uh, wait, uh, where did you get all this? <laughs> where did you steal it? No, I bought it all. <laughs> but how, if you're poor? Um, actually, my grandmother left some nice inheritance. Enough, you're lying. You surely bought the cheapest cosmetics. Oh, no. These are not cheap at all. Look at this one here. I don't even have this. Oh, my God. I think this one will look much better on my lashes than yours. <laughs> Of course not! It's mine, Britney! Girl, so are you Give going to, to be my friends right now? Uh, mm. of course. From now on, we will be the best friends ever. And you still have money, right? Of course! Wow! Amazing! Hey, give it back to me! Oh, don't worry about this. It's way better if we keep it safe for you. In that way, no one can steal it. Mm-hmm. Of course, you're right. Um, and do you have any more money? Well, I have a little more, but not here. Um, then go bring it quickly. We'll wait for you right here. Okay. <laughs> How naive she is. <laughs> uh-huh. It's going to be very easy to trick her into thinking we really want to be her friends. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> this is everything I've earned today. We're going to keep it with our savings. I wish I could spend all that money. <sighs> Daughter, you already know we can't do it. We have to get a new decent apartment to live in. I know that. And after that, I'll buy the most beautiful dress I see. Uh-huh. Mom, I need some money. Um, what is that over there? Susie, it's our savings. And you can't use them for anything else. But mom... Um, calm down, big sister. Don't you understand that we need them? I don't care. I want a computer. But daughter, that is very expensive. Maybe we can think of something else. No, I won't think of anything else. And this is my money. Susie, have you gone totally crazy? No. I need this money more than you do. Goodbye. Um, what? Mom, are you really not going to do anything? Emma, don't scream. She'll become a millionaire. You will see. She'll give us a lot of chocolate. Well, it's Susie, so even if she became a millionaire, she would not share it with us. It's not true. Susie is a very good girl. I'm sure she wouldn't forget about us. Ah! And now you will go shopping with the best friends in the whole world. Susie, you are really cool. Susie, uh, you're going to buy new clothes for us, right? Well... Hey, come on. You're pretty good at giving us expensive gifts. Well, of course I'll do it. Oh, uh, we're going to choose an outfit for me too. Um... What do you want that for? You're already pretty enough. Yeah? Oh, well, I thought that my clothes were not fashionable. No, that's already the latest in fashion. Everyone will admire you for it. <laughs> and compared to you, we have much worse clothes. Really? So, you have already convinced me. Hey, well, let's not waste more time. Let's try everything on. Um, now I have some great friends. I finally get to go shopping with them. Mom, why do we have to be bagging on the street? Emma, you already know we have to make money any way that we can, honey. And why isn't Susie with us? She always gets to spend it all. That's not fair. I don't have a penny for myself. She spends a lot of time studying. You have to understand her. Yeah, I think if we invest in this business, we will have huge income. Oh, wow. Mom, I think that could be our first customer today. But I'm serious. Good morning, elegant young man. You are so handsome. Uh, thank you. You know, we also have our own business. We actually clean shoes. We can make yours shine. Well, let's try it. Fantastic. Come with us. Uh, hey, I'll call you in 10 minutes. Ugh. Ooh. Whoa. Emma, take care of it. Uh, are you actually sure you know what you're doing? Of course. We have been in this business for 10 years. Professionals. So don't hesitate at all. All right. It's ready. Let's take a look. What on earth did you do? You ruined my shoes. This is real leather. Please let us fix it, huh? No, thank you. You will make it worse. 
I'm on my way right now. Uh, we're not gonna make any money like this. Oh, Emma, look at that. I think he lost his phone. Hmm? A stroke of luck. Great, we can keep it, but first let's call Susie to see how she's doing. Of course. Do you remember her number? Of course, she's my sister. Hello? Emma? Mother? Why are you calling me? Hey, I'm in class, doing my homework. Hey, I cannot talk right now. They call me to the blackboard. Oh, getting their call right now is the last thing I need. They're always bothering me. <sighs> Don't worry, Susie's in class. She was doing her homework. Oh, what a smart girl. Listen, let me see that phone just for a moment. <gasps> Mom, I think it's broken. Oh, no. I hope that millionaire doesn't come back to get his phone. Excuse me, didn't you see my phone? Uh, well, we... Oh, but what? Is it broken? No, no it just fell by accident. We can fix it. <sighs> you damaged my shoes. And now my phone. You girls should be ashamed. If you don't want me to call the police, you better get out of here immediately. Let's go now. Uh, okay, Brittany, do we still have money left? <laughs> of course we have enough for a month, as long as Susie doesn't spend this money on her. <laughs> <laughs> that girl is pathetic. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey girls, thank you for inviting me to this beautiful house. The bathtub is so amazing, it makes a lot of bubbles. <laughs> it's a jacuzzi. Susie, I don't understand. Who the hell gave you permission to use my bathrobe? Well, it's really pretty and so soft. Just lend it to me. <laughs> no, did you see that? Come on, calm down. By the way, why don't we go to the beauty salon today? Where to? Why spend so much money on that? You can do much better treatments at home. Uh, don't you think it's much better to hire a professional? Uh, yes, it's way better to have an expert take care of this. All right, just give me the money then and I'll pay everything for you. Uh, you know, uh, I think we should try and have a spa day right here. Mm -hmm. Really? All right. I even have something that could be of great use to us. Wait a minute. Are you really sure this is a good idea? There is something weird about all of this. Of course, I've seen it in the movies. It's the best area. Ah! Are you crazy or what? Hey, why are you yelling? It's just that I didn't find small fish and I bought them a little bit bigger. They should still work just fine. You're totally crazy. Why did we agree to all this in the first place? Hey, girls, I didn't mean to offend you like that. It's a real treatment. Do you want to try it again? No. no. We are already fed up with your treatments. Let's go to a real beauty salon. This is awful. Ugh. Oh, time to work, no time to sleep and rest. Come, only today, sweets at the lowest price on the entire market. Oh, Brittany, look at that. The cleaner is actually selling candy too. And she's also wearing an ugly costume. <laughs> <laughs> Good afternoon, you can choose the most delicious sweets. <laughs> Such cheap and disgusting sweets. Hey, don't spoil my merchandise. Why are you doing this? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think we offended the cleaner. You can go and cry if you want. <laughs> oh, no. What is she doing here? And wearing such a horrible costume. Hey, that's enough. Stop it. If she recognizes me, then she will embarrass me in front of the girl. <laughs> <laughs> hey, stop, please! Well, stop it! We should go now. Oh, but wait. Just let me make fun of this poor woman who's selling cheap candy. <laughs> Susie? Is it really you? Hey, how do you know my name, loser? Oh, oh, my daughter. Daughter? Susie, is there anything you want to tell us? No, it's the first time I've seen this woman. Let's get out of here. Oh, uh, yeah, we should go to the coffee shop for a cocktail. But first, let's go shopping. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
I don't understand what's happening. How did Susie end up like this? I don't know how she could do something like that to me. I'm so sick of everything. I can't stand this humiliation. <laughs> Where the hell is she now? Yeah, we need her money. <gasps> hey, girls. Did you have to buy so many things at the store? Ah! Uh... Susie, what are you doing? I'm fine. I'm not hurt. Nothing happened. Thanks for worrying about me. We are worried about our shoes if they did not get scratched. Be careful next time. You almost ruined all our things. Uh, good afternoon, girls. Uh, are you ready to order something? Yes, you're going to bring the whole menu. A salad, a coffee, donuts, and sandwiches. And I'll have a large cappuccino and two cocktails. Um... Hey, Susie, do you know what you're ordering? I guess I'll have a glass of water. I'll be back in a moment. What about you? Aren't you hungry? No, I'm on a strict diet because I want to lose some weight now. Oh, great. So I'll have two more donuts and a hot tea. <laughs> Me too. Hey, okay, girls. Keep the money and I'll go because now I have a lot of things that I gotta do right now. Bye-bye. Oh my god, it's not a lot of money. <sighs> it's okay, I'm still glad she's gone. Listen, uh, let's go out with the boys with this fool's money. <laughs> All right. <sighs> I will sue this blouse for my daughter and it will be as good as new. Mom, I need more money. Uh, honey, money for what? Look, I even sued you this blouse just to make you happy. I don't need your silly blouse! <laughs> Here! Susie, what have you done? You're my mother and you have to give me money! But if I already gave you the last thing I had, I don't have any more money! Listen, I need you to give me more money right now! Daughter, you need money for a school, right? Yeah, for school! I have an option that could maybe help. Grandma's jewelry, our last savings. <gasps> I don't get it. Where are the jewels? What jewelry are you talking about? I don't understand what you mean. Oh no. This was our last chance to get a proper house. Now we're going to live here forever. For real? I can't continue living in this house. Why are we so poor? I'm leaving. Susie! <laughs> Mom, why are you crying? Did Susie yell at you again? No, someone has stolen all the jewels. Everything we had to survive. Susie did it. I told you, she's been trying to get money wherever she goes. Emma, what are you talking about? Susie couldn't have done that, and I believe her. Well, yeah, she's lying to your face. She doesn't respect you at all. And besides, she's been hanging out with really bad people. It's all nonsense. Some thieves broke in and stole our jewelry. It couldn't be her. Oh, sure, because anyone would guess that our house is filled with really expensive jewelry. Okay, if I find out that it was Susie who stole from us, I'll teach her to never steal again. She will see. I'm done. Okay, man, tell me, do you like Susie or what? Ethan, it's enough. Well, come on, tell me, do you like her? Even if I liked her, I don't know if it's gonna be mutual. Honestly, I think you should talk to her. And what about you and Leila? I think she's trying to flirt with you. Oh, I definitely don't like her. She's really toxic. Yeah, I agree. Good morning. Hey, uh, good morning. Are you Brittany? That's right, it's me. Please come in. That's great. Jake, go ahead. Excuse me? Oh, wait, uh, what did you order now? Lots of delicious sweets. I can't believe it. All of this is enough for a whole month. It's amazing since we have a very dumb friend with money like Susie. We should take advantage of it. Okay, the boxes will cost you, well, uh, about $5,700. That's it. Wait a moment, please. Our walking wallet will be here soon to pay for everything. Very good. We'll wait in the car then. Uh -huh. Oh my god. We just need that fool to arrive and pay. Oh, girls, hello. 
Oh, Susie, you're finally back. Um, wait, uh, where have you been? That doesn't matter, I'm already here. You know, it's good that you're back because we actually need your money right now. Oh, what for? Uh, yeah, well, we prepared a surprise for you. Thank you so much, but girls, I have no money left. What do you mean, no? Well, I gave you all the money. I had to buy clothes and food. Oh, if that's the case, then get the hell out of here. We don't need a penniless friend. Wait, girls, what should I do then? I don't know. Maybe you should steal from rich people if you value our friendship, of course. Steal? I'll do that. Girls, I'll do anything for you. Mm, wait, are you being serious? Of course. After all, we're best friends. I'll be right back. <laughs> Unbelievable. Has she really run off to rob someone? I think so. She's so silly. <laughs> <laughs> what happened, girls? Are you going to pay for the sweets or not? Uh, you know, we have decided that we are not going to need it. Mm -hmm. Are you serious? And you tell me that now? Don't yell. Get everything out of here before I lose my patience. Jake, let's take everything. <sighs> and you ladies, next time think very carefully before ordering anything at all. We should find someone else with money. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, this might not have been a good idea. I don't know how I got into this, but I'm doing it for my friends. Oh no, I think someone's coming. I hope he doesn't see me. <sighs> my money. Yeah, you're gonna be safe in here. It feels good to have a lot of money. Oh, that's awesome. It must be my lucky day today. Oh my god, this is a lot of money. Enough for my friends and I could also share some of it with mom and Emma. Although, I guess I'd better have fun and enjoy it. With all of this, my best friends are going to be very happy. Say no more, you have to close that deal now. Oh no. <sighs> but how are you going to tell me that you can't... Wait a sec. Oops, I think they caught me. Oh, and who are you, girl? What are you doing in my house? Uh, me? I'm the new cleaning girl. I'm just taking out the trash. Hmm, how strange. Surely my butler forgot to notify me about this staff change. <sighs> Surely, sir, don't you worry. Well, please wait here. I'd better call him and we'll check this very quickly. Wait, no need. I'm going to leave anyways. See you later. One moment. Uh, okay, that girl is really weird. Uh, Susie, where are you taking us? You're about to see it now. Oh, I hope it's not a dump. All right, we're here. Now you can see. Oh, is this the exclusive club we always go to, isn't it? That's right. Welcome to the greatest party for my best friends right here. You said party? <laughs> Did you finally find money? Of course. I would do anything for my friend. Foo, but uh, no hugs, okay? Hello, girls. Here, here we, we are. are. Oh, awesome. I didn't expect you to be at the party with us. Susie invited us to the party, and we decided to come. It's great that you came, Ben. Let's dance together. Brittany. Uh, Ethan, are you not going to ask me to dance with you? Well... Of course you want to. Let's dance. Relax. Don't worry about me. I have no problem dancing alone. The most important thing is that my friends have fun. Everybody to the ground, hands on your head. The cops have arrived. Ah! Wait, what is going on? Huh? Get down. Now tell me, quickly. Which of you has seen this thief before? Oh god, is that Susie? Oh no, now they've got me. Yeah, it's you. Get up. Wait. Of course. Security cameras tell a different story. Come on. You're under arrest. 
I can't believe it. How did this happen? She's so dumb. If you're going to steal, you should do it with caution. I still can't believe it. Why do we hang out with her? Poor girl. Guys, come on, we have to help her. Wait, she has to take responsibility for her actions. We should dance. B but... Come on, let's dance together. <sighs> Sit down. All right, Susie, now tell me. Why did you steal the money from that safe? Believe me, I didn't want to steal that money. It just happened. If that's true, then you just have to return all the money. And then I can let you go. Return it? Um, the money's gone. Oh, daughter, don't tell them anything. What are you doing here? Mom, I... <sighs> Your daughter is a thief. She stole money from the richest man in town. And now she's going to spend 10 years in jail. Oh, that can't be true. What are we going to do? Oh, one moment. Susie hasn't done anything wrong. I asked her to rob that man. I have a heart disease and I needed that money for a treatment. Mom, what are you doing? <sighs> I missed the part where that's my problem. So you are going to jail. Mommy. Okay, just let my daughter go now. She's not guilty of anything. I will take the punishment. So get into the cell. You're under arrest. Susie, all of this is your fault. How could you possibly be so reckless? Em, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. It doesn't matter anymore. Mom, are you okay? Mom, please forgive me. I didn't want any of this to happen. Daughter, don't worry. It's not your fault. Mom, what will we do without you? Girls, don't you worry. You can do it. You are adults and you know how to take care of yourselves. Mom. All right, that's it. Your time's up. Get out of here. Hey, Mom, I'll get you out of here. I'll get all the money back, I promise. Mom, no. Unbelievable. Susie, hey, was all of this your fault or am I wrong? Emma, listen. How could you do something as ugly as this to us? You know, you're no longer a sister to me now. Emma, forgive me. I'll honestly make it up to you. You don't have any other option. You have to help mom to get out of jail. Oh, I have a good idea. Where is mommy's Mickey Mouse costume? Well, who cares? Right now, it can't help us. It will. I'll wear it to sell candy, just like mom. Okay, I'll get it. Take it, but I don't believe you. Thanks. I'll pay back all the money I sold today and get mom out. I promise. I wish I could believe you. I wish I could get my mom out of jail as soon as possible. Come over here. Buy the nicest candy in the city. Don't miss a chance to try all of it. <laughs> Layla, look who's selling cheap candy right now in that ugly costume. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Go to hell. <laughs> hey, my friend, have you forgotten who you're talking to right now? With two big traitors. Why are you so clueless in life? We made a wish list and you couldn't even steal the money properly. All that happened to me is all your fault. I should have known better at that moment. Now my mom is in jail because of you. It's all your fault. You should have thought with your head. I was so wrong. You're not my friend. It was my mom and now she's in jail. Did you really think that we were going to be friends? Even if you have money, you are not at our level. Do you understand? <laughs> hey, what are you doing? <laughs> You're, You're a loser. A loser. <laughs> <laughs> hey, get away from her. Leave her alone. Oh, you're such a hero now. Why are you even defending her? You can't keep messing with her. Yeah, come on, Layla. We have nothing to do with them. Let him stay with that poor girl. <laughs> You'll be just as much of a loser as she is. Get out of here, both of you. Ben, thank you for standing up for me, really. You're welcome. But why are you wearing such a funny outfit? It's a long story, but I need the money to get my mother out of jail. Well, I don't have a lot of money... But I think it's gonna be enough. I could help you. Wow, well, I really appreciate it. But why are you suddenly helping me? Well, I just want you to be happy, Susie. Thank you, Ben. You're a true friend. A friend? That's right. Friends help each other. 
My poor mom. How could Susie do something like this? I still cannot believe it. Oh, watch where you're going. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Why are you crying? Is everything all right? No, I'm really not okay. I'm sorry. Let's sit down and you can tell me everything. My mother went to jail because of my sister, who just wanted to be a rich girl. Oh no, that's a shame. Is there anything I can do to help you? I really don't know. It's all a big mess right now. Well, don't cry. I'll help you and we'll think of something. Really? Um, thank you. Um, I don't know you at all. <sighs> Sorry I didn't introduce myself. I'm Ethan. And I'm Emma. Nice to meet you, Emma. Don't worry. You'll get through this. I'm gonna work until I get the last penny. This is horrible. I hope my mom forgives me. Susie, hello. Oh, Ben, what are you doing here? I came here to see you, and by the way, I have a surprise for you here. Oh, wow. Is there an event today? Not really. I just wanted to make you smile today. Thank you, Ben, for supporting me through such a hard time. You're a good friend, you know? Susie, we're not friends. What? Are you trying to trick me just like Layla and Brittany? No, Susie, you don't understand. I like you. I'm in love with you. No, no, no. This cannot be actually real. Don't you feel the same way about me? Of course I do. I'm just shocked. Unbelievable. I couldn't say it for a long time. Uh, can I help you? No, I can do it by myself. You could get your clothes dirty. Uh, I don't care. As long as I help you. Susie, where are you going? It seems that something bad's happening. Mom, you're really strong. You have to get better. Mom, what's wrong with her? Mom's unconscious. This is all your fault. Mom, I'm so sorry. Girls, I'm so glad you're both here. How are you feeling, Mommy? Are you feeling better? No, my head hurts. You have to hold on, everything will be alright. Oh my god. What's happening? Uh, I've signed us up for a charity website to help Mom, and a millionaire has just donated a lot of money. What a generous man. Yeah, it's him. Oh no, I think it's the man that we met. And we ruined his shoes and his phone. That's right. Uh, I don't get it. Let me see. Oh no. It's the same one that I stole the money from. Daughter, I hope that now you realize that the most important thing in life is family. Of course. Mom, sister. I love you so much. Please forgive me. 